Hello and welcome to another video. In this one, we're doing a mech build for the Incubus hero, the Saber. So here's a mech, and let's go take a look at its build. In the mech lab, we have three missile hardpoints, two in the right arm, one in the center torso, three ballistics, two in the right torso, one in the left torso, and two energy hardpoints, one in each torso. For this design, I've gone with sort of an SRM striker with a little bit of backup. So we have triple SRM sixes in their various spots, three tons of ammo, which are being boosted by our ammo uh, nodes in the skill tree. We've got triple machine guns, regular machine guns, and then dual micro lasers. And the micro lasers are there just sort of like as an add on. They're hit scan just like the machine guns they can be fired basically with them they're almost heat neutral when we're just firing those two by themselves and so this is just our, our backup five weapons with our main punch of triple serum six it's decent enough hero it's I'm, I'm i'm finding i'm performing well but not oh my god super amazing with this so far with my testing if you're going to do something that is machine gun laser focused, you're more you're going to have better uh, performance if you are in something like the Piranha. If you're going to do something with more SRM focused, you're probably better in something like the Arctic Wolf or the Jenner 2C. So it's, it's kind of trying to fit a middle ground. I'm contemplating whether or not I should take these sixes into fours in order to have slightly less missile spread, as this one has five missile spread, the fours will have a total of, what, 4.5 missile spread, be able to be a little more accurate with my missiles, and then use that saved weight, saved ton and a half if I did that, and then put it into upgrading the lasers and machine guns and such into a little more uh, high-powered variants. Maybe get these to uh, medium pulse or something along those lines. But as it stands for now, we're going to give this a try. For the skills, I've gone just with a really generic skill build that, for testing purposes, to see what I want to change about this in the future. We've gone down the left side of the tree just to get all of the missile nodes and some laser duration nodes. We're not really that concerned about our MG ammo nodes, as I haven't run out of MG ammo yet, but I have run out of SRM ammo. Survival, just because I like being durable, although I'm contemplating trying taking away most of the survival and getting most of the mobility and seeing how that goes. Operations for some extra cooling and then sensors to get us 60% radar deprivation to keep us hidden from those damn alarms. But let us go out onto the battlefield for a couple matches and see how the Saber runs with this SRM striker type design. And for our first match, as we can see in the chat here, he mustn't screw up because he's on camera. But then I used the wrong Yor and I had to correct myself. I will not get my grammar wrong, or at least I'll try not to. Let us move forward to the front lines. We are looking for the enemy, getting some scouting information off, and uh, seeing what we can see. Not using the free to play account, I see. Yes, new hero build video. <laughs> All right, there's a commandos coming up. Commando one B. Small lasers from six. Okay. Okay. Did you put up UAV? Uh, UAV in G seven. G seven. Thanks for shooting down. Just gotta call it out nicely, and then when somebody responds to your commands or responds to your request you gotta thank them for it positive reinforcement is how you build allies and build performance in this game phoenix hawk is at 100 percent our catapult over there is getting his ass handed to him i like that i want to be a part of that <laughs> I want to go help that Phoenix Hawk. Phoenix Hawk, looks like you've got a few enemies on your way. You might want to bug out. 
New target acquired. Target spotted. Bad Phoenix Hawk needs to get GTFO. He's losing health. We're going to be here to support him. If people try to chase, we will be there to eat their chasers as they may overextend. Looks like you get two chasers, a centurion and a commando. And they're probably going to back off here. Oh, no. They're committing. No, they're here, they're here. I'm chasing them back into the assault. Here we go. We got a little life fight over here on the right side. Where's that centurion? I want you. You are my target. Probably the best thing I can throw my SRMs into right now. So there's a guy down there, far right, down behind that. Boom, right, good hit into that guy. No hit on those SRMs. Very widespread on them. Oh, hello. Catapult way out in the front, kill him. Oh yeah, he's wrecked. He down, all right. Excellent work. Got around here. Let's use this cover. Let's get up close. Hello. Blast you with some SRMs. I definitely have more firepower than you in a stand-up fight. So I'm happy to trade shots with you. Commandos, both side torsos open. Red smoke on the corner. Thankfully, it's a very poorly uh, targeted artillery strike. We can start to sneak this corner here. Get some shots downrange. Just working these angles. They don't expect the shots coming from above. Our assaults in the back are getting eaten. We should push hard on this right side right now. We've only got a couple guys here. We can push around and kill. Lost a couple of sixes. That's all right. We're coordinating our team. Going around the corner. Excellent kill. Going around the corner. Alpha. Dragon. I'm distracting. Go, 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 go. we go we're sacrificing all of our armor here but we managed to distract them a whole bunch their guys are taking a bunch of damage as arms are pushing in and getting the damage downrange drop that gargles mm, he's down direwolf delta right torso this. They're going to eat our back end here, unfortunately. I can circle you faster than you can s turn. Got you down. Good distraction. Lima? Sun Spider? What is this guy in the back? What does he have? Is he all missiles? If he is, I can go harass him. If he isn't, I can't. Ugh, he's got a couple smalls. Yeah, he's got a couple smalls, and that's it. For close range defense, push in on him. I will pepper his ass with bullets. And we're going to get a free assault kill here. As we rip Charlie to bits. Excellent. Up the hill. got taken out, unfortunately. Hey, but we did 565 damage. That is more than enough than you would expect from a 30-ton mech. Which I believe this is 30 tons, right? <laughs> Shows you my knowledge of the mech off the top of my head. GG to our opponents. We're going to lose this one, but it was fun. As our last goes down. Good try, guys. Let us see what the post-game stats are like. And this is during... They have an event going on right now, which is quite nice. That they have the hero and special bonus. Instead of being 30%, 
is now 50%. So we scroll down our C bill rewards, our mech bonus, and our premium time are actually equal. Extra. Oh my god. An extra like 130,000 C bills there? It's beautiful. 247,000 C bills earned with one kill, six assists, 565 damage done. More than enough for a light. And we were definitely in the top portion of our team in terms of performance. So let us try out another match with the Saber. And for our next match with the Saber, we've got Domination All Mining Collective. Nice brawl map with a brawly pokey light mech. Should be okay. I believe that I am fast enough here that I should be able to take the center. You can only really do it on this side. Ooh, Dark enemy in the center already. already. Because you just have that, that super short... Oh, I just wrecked that guy! He was not expecting that! <laughs> I just took his side off! Out of nowhere! Oh, back in the cover, back in the cover. All right, guys, get in the center. I need your help. New target acquired. All right, let's get this guy. Let's push him off the edge, right into the enemies. Incubus with the death push, kill it. Push the center, push the center. Come across here, cutting across. Uh, lost my serms, but that's okay. You got nothing on me, little incubus. <laughs> that guy's so beat up. I feel so sorry for him. Uh, I did so much damage to him. The center is ours if we hold W. It is representing win. Strong crow on the right side needs a friend. We got a Madcap Mark II on the left in the open. Oh, good artillery, go away. Several mechs on the left side in the open, curling around her back. are still going well. Several enemy UAVs above us. Can I warp through this guy? Please let me go through. I want to get off this wild ride. Alright, where to go now? I guess I can just try to hold this angle here. Mad cat, mad dog. Yeah, let's go eat the mad dog. Sure, that makes sense. Makes sense. Oh, he's dead. Oh, that's an artillery strike. Oh, I'm probably gonna die here. <laughs> Don't hurt me, artillery. Target acquired. Oh man, this match was going so well. And now it's going so bad. Come on, bastards! Die. Don't hurt me. I'm, I'm not. A, I'm a nice guy. Don't hurt me. God damn it! I got taken out. But, how we do for damage? 234. That is unfortunate. It's a little lower than I expected, but I had fun that match. Ah, it doesn't matter that I didn't perform very well that match. It leaves me time here to reflect on the build as we watch the match finish up. Like I said earlier in this, it doesn't really do the Serm Striker build like, say, a Medcat. That's what's in front of me. Uh, Jenner 2C could do. It doesn't do it like a Arctic Wolf could do. It also can't do the lasers and MGs like a Piranha can or other variants of the Incubus in the specific hero. Hmm. It's, it's a weird hybrid build. I'm contemplating we can take those down to fours to de-emphasize the 
missile portion of this, get a little bit better focus on those missiles so that their uh, spread is lower. And maybe move the lasers into something like heavy lasers or medium pulse to improve that damage. Because that damage is a little bit more targeted, a little bit easier to hit with your enemies. Those serms are quite spread. So I think what I might do for this mech in the future. But I think this was a successful little experiment. I found that this thing performs generally between 300 and uh, 500 experience, not experience, damage done per match. This was a little bit lower than I expected. And yeah, it's a decent little striker. Got 335 damage done, zero kills, 10 assists, 234. 335,000 sea bills earned. My god, I can't speak. 234 damage done. Right as we were running up to the front, and we were very aggressive onto that left side, we can only really do that because you have enough cover, because the cover on that side is totally solid. The incubus that was up there didn't expect it. We put a bunch of serms into its butt, and it lost half its weapons right off the beginning of the match. And that's... that was fun. That made that match entertaining for me. But yeah, enough of my rambling. That's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching, and good hunting.